Beatrice? The name sounds familiar. Who is she? And what kind of curse is this? It could be the Rapunzel Snow White Sleeping Beauty curse, like Lynn said, maybe. You know, she's been writing in her diary a lot lately. It must be in the nightstand. Check it out while I take another look around the house. Maybe this masked man left some traces behind. Sure, we're gonna rifle through her diary. Uh, what is under the bed here? It's freaking me out. I feel like that totally should be a collectible, but it's not. All right, we've got some um, horsies here. Half of the horse is missing, and it's the one holding the photo, of course. Of course. Adams, thank you so much for the follow today. Great, you found our first collectible flower. Each flower you find will unlock information about it. Okay, folks, we're looking for flowers. Flowers are our collectible. So if you do spot any flowers, do shout that out. I have no idea what's moving under the bed. And I'm afraid to look out for it. Oh, apparently that's a thing too. <gasps> snowflakes! So we are looking for snowflakes and flowers, folks. Shout those out in the chat. I don't consider them to be spoilers. We have photos. Thank you. It's sticky. Well, if I ever need to glue something together. Leroy. Dear Leroy, I'm doing better. My family is safe. Rosalind is the light of my life. I hope one day you will find someone who will conquer your heart too. Love is truly a gift. Always your friend, Richard. Dear Leroy, I must admit you're right. I've been worried. My wife, Rosalind, suddenly changed. She's hiding something. She's looking paler and weaker every day. I even hired a detective to investigate what's going on. I hope I find an answer. Always your friend, Richard. Okay. So we've got some notes here. That fire is looking a little suspicious. Why is it blue? It is weird. Okay, we have to look under the bed. Let's do it. Um. Hi. What you doing there? Why do they have a puppet under their bed? Was that some sort of like... Well, uh, <laughs> I won't say it. Why is there a puppet under the bed? All right, flower part. I don't even know what this is supposed to mean. What was the... Two keys don't match. Okay, I gotta match the keys. Match the keys, please. And that's not a match. Excellent. We have a sunflower key. That is weird that they have a puppet under their bed. Uh-huh. The puppet was gorgeous. Yes, no doubt. So this is where we're going to be putting those pictures and rearranging. I do have a sunflower key. I don't know what that's going to be for uh, opening here. Wow. Poor girl, I must think of a way to save her. Crazy. Digging the uh, nightgown there. So, two out of two, I can go back here and let's do this. Uh, <laughs> you know what I was thinking about with respect to that puppet under the bed? Uh, okay. <laughs> hey, look what we found! A diary! And we're gonna rifle through it like it belongs to us. Dear diary. Uh, what? Honey spoon! I set the best code for my diary. Our wedding date. I doubt even Leroy will remember. So long as the doesn't flip over our wedding photo. What? Why would Leroy not remember their wedding day? That seems kind of cruel to say that. Uh, all right, honeydew. Let's do it. We now have sticky honey. And we're ready to fix the horse, of course. Slurp, slurp. Yum. Not that kind of doll. <laughs> hey now. 
Uh, let's see here. What else we got? No, nope, that does not go there. Apparently that goes there. We're making a horse. A sticky slurpy horse. Horse half, really. Oh yes, the stereotypes of men forgetting important dates. Ah, we have to match the right top with the right bottom. Three out of three photos. Let's go ahead and put those back up on here. No, 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 I don't need the diary yet. There we go. Now, uh, let's mix and match these to their appropriate spots. Sure. Beautiful. That's their wedding day. They were married on 1885. Wow. That's a bit of a long time ago. 1885. Let's put this back together. It looks we like moved we to a new town. Oh, geez. I know I'll become a lead actress here. I'll play Ophelia. Okay. It's better for Leroy not to know about the rumors surrounding this role. Wait, what were the rumors? I got the role of Ophelia. I don't believe in curses. I'm sure nothing bad will happen to me. Ha 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 Foreshadowing. A strange birthmark appeared on my arm. I hope it's nothing bad. <laughs> I'll ask Beatrice for advice. She's my only friend here and the best actress I know. Really? Beatrice, suspect number one. Of course. Beatrice is an actress that Angela mentioned before. They were working together. Well, what does it mean? Is this girl in danger like Angela? Let's go to the theater quickly. That... Oh, I clicked. I thought he was st done talking. All right, we're going to go to the theater. So, how do I get to the Quickly, theater? To the theater. They'll be closing soon. I have a coin, so I'm going to go over here and deal with this puppet face. Oh, okay. We needed the mask half, did we? And uh, don't forget, we're looking for uh, snowflakes and flowers. So there's our snowflake. And apparently that's a flower we needed. Sweet. Bridge mechanism. First, swap the mask half so they match, then insert all the gears so that they all turn together. Wow. Um, it's like a fairly straightforward puzzle. Oh. Oh my gosh, look at the gears. Holy moly, that's a lot of gears. That's gears for days here, folks. Holy cow. Um, who doesn't love gear puzzles? This is, <laughs> uh, this is a lot of gears. Um, hey, bottom one's done. Mm-hmm. Now, we have to do this big one over here, I think. No? This one's probably a big one. It's all coming together now. Big gear. Oh. Something's not right. Excellent. Don't let it grind my gears. I will do that. I would not let it grind my gears. Mm-hmm. So, let's see here. Snowflakes and flowers, folks. What the heck? What's with the blood? Holy moly. Ah! The theater's closed. Um... I, we just got threw out. That's not very nice. 
I need something to cut the rope. You have a knife. Ooh, somebody drew flowers and wrote some words. I should probably copy this information down. I do not have a pen though, or pencil or whatever. Yes, that was very suspicious. What does this guy want to say to us? We're closed for rehearsal. I'm the director. Can I help you? Just a little bit. Beatrice is my new star. We're lucky she agreed to replace Angela. The other actresses are afraid to perform now. She's in the dressing room getting ready for rehearsal. You may speak with her if you like. We are looking for a reason why we cannot get inside the theater. Oh, snap! <laughs> it was a dolly! The dolly did it! Mm hmm. Oh no, the snow in this game looks lovely. Like, you could run around and catch these snowflakes. Snowflake top right of a building. Thank you so much. The snowflakes must be morphing. So I would have swore I saw it, but... Alright, how do I get it out? Maybe if I had something to pull it through the window opening. Uh, I don't have any of these things. What do we have over this way? Uh, I bet you... No? Oh, I see. It's these metal charms here. Aha! Now we have a magnet to get that out of there. And we have three to three charms. Sweet. Theater. Ring the bells in the right order to call Beatrice. The numbers below are the hint. Five. Um. Mm, okay. Why wouldn't this be? The numbers are connected to the limbs. Oh, jeez. Oh, okay. Got it. So that's a five. Um. Two. Okay. Snake is one, horse is four. Hello? There's someone here in the dark. Please open the door from the outside. <laughs> Why are Just you locked? Just the code. Love, purity, selfishness. <laughs> Please, I'm scared. Oh no, if you're a fan, write your name here. I want to put Veronica. Ha ha ha. Woo! We're not ready for the code yet. I want to, like, draw this over here first. Where do I put it? Um. Okay, I guess I don't... Oh, I see. We have to put it with the paper first. Ah. Wow. Brandon the Cookie. Thank you so much for being... I believe it's a sponsor on YouTube. Thanks so much. Hopefully you had a good... I think you said you were playing soccer today. Thank you, thank you so much for that. Super kind of you to do that. Flowers, please. Find all the flowers. One more flower. Well, what's with the twins? The rose means love and passion. The cornflower means patriotism and loyalty. The snowdrop means innocence and purity. The violet means modesty and beauty. The jonquil means youth and selfishness. What's with the blood? You mean the jam. Jam for days. Oh wow, that's super rusty. Holy cow, <laughs> I've never seen so much rust. <laughs> oh boy. Beatrice is in the dressing room. Did you talk to her? Not yet, my friend, not yet. Working on it. Dressing room, this way. 
theater this way. We now have the code to solve this. Here we go, folks. We're going to do this. Uh, I would suspect this game will be out probably in the next couple months, just based on the kind of wintry theme it has. You would like the Rose in the, of Purity? So what do we got here? Start with love. Love. Uh, then go to purity. Then go to self selfishness. What was that? I'm starting to believe in the curses. Uh-oh, it's dark in here. We gotta light it up. 